Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the vlog. You might not be able to see me very well, but it's about 9.15 at night, and I'm out here. Eric forgot to put his chickens away, so I thought I'd do him a favor here. Come here, guys. Come here, Cluckies. Can't really do it with one hand here. Come here, guys. Come here, Dickie. What are you doing, Dickie? Come on. I put their food and water in. You go on in. Come on, guys. Click, 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 click. Go on in. Get up on your, get up on your perch, guys. Yep. Look out your window. Can't really see them up there now. Hey, Ken. There they are. I got their food and water in there. So then, all I got to do is get this door shut. All right. Just like that. They are locked in for the night, safe from any potential predators. Me and Dad have to get up early and do farm chores tomorrow. And uh, then we'll be doing some other stuff in the afternoon, I believe. We'll be doing some other stuff that I'm going to show you guys as well. We're going to have a lot of fun. So hope you guys do enjoy. I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, guys. It is now the next day. It is about 12.15 in the afternoon. Uh, me and Dad got up bright and early, uh, 4 o'clock this morning. We went in, I went ahead and dad did some paperwork, got, got caught up on his hours and stuff. I went in and chored the hogs, made sure all the hogs were good and ready to rock and roll. And then we went and we watered the cows up in the big lot, up in the field. So they got watered and then we went and we checked on the cows at Scott's dad's place. There's only a few there now. A lot of them down there got sold. So there's only, there's not even 15 head down there. So there's not very many, but we wanted to make sure that they had food and that their water was good. Got them all taken care of. And uh, now, the, what I said last night, we were gonna do chores and then we got some fun stuff going on. A few videos ago, I, uh, well, I guess it was more than a few videos ago, I published a video called Off to the Races. And it was when uh, I was headed to the racetrack and I was gonna be meeting up with my dad in Jonesy. He runs the big grain cart during the harvest operation for the farm. And uh, he has a race car and he was racing. And I showed you a video, of, I showed you his car and I was in it and I revved it up and, and all this stuff. And ever since then, I haven't really filmed, but I, we've been coming to a lot of races over here at this racetrack. And last week we went to a race at another city that Jonesy was racing in. And uh, we help in the pits, we're kind of his pit crew. We help change his tires if he blows a tire, you know, all that stuff. But um, well, I don't know. How, I guess I don't know how long it's been now, but uh, a while back, a few about a month ago, maybe at this point, a little over a month ago, I can't I can't remember when it was, but uh, me and Dad got so kind of invested and we really got interested in the racing and watching Jonesy race and watching all the races here at the racetrack. Um, the, that's why, yeah, I said it here at the racetrack. I am at the racetrack right now. I'm in the pits. There's nobody else here, but uh, we are here at the racetrack. Jonesy is going to be on his way with his car, and we're going to meet up. But, um, like I said, me and Dad got so interested in racing and stuff like this that uh, I went ahead, and uh, as a, me and Dad kind of made a decision together and uh, that we were going to work as a team and make this kind of our team project. But uh, I spent the money. And I bought, me and dad, this. <laughs> I bought a race car. Number three. This thing is ready to rock and roll, man. We, uh, I bought it a while back and we've been doing some work on it. Getting it, you know, legal for the track here getting it all ready to roll but this is it this is our car it's a 79 cutlass is what it is um it's got a 355 engine in it we did a whole bunch of work on it like we put this guard on it we put the stickers on we got a whole bunch of stuff on there we put that roof sign on with the 03 we did a lot all these decals here we put on it's amazing but this is the first time we're racing it so uh, the guy that we bought it from, 
only raced it like six times and uh, so this car hasn't been raced much period so we're gonna dad's gonna run it tonight in the hobby stock class against Jonesy and a few of our other friends that race so it'll be nice I'll get some footage for you guys of our new race car running on the track I've, I've, I've been so excited to show you guys but I've been waiting until we get all of our personal tweaks done to it so that it's officially our car and it is uh, but I'm excited so I hope you guys do enjoy we're gonna wait for Jonesy to show up the trailer driving her in the pits we're gonna we're gonna park her in front of the trailer here hey Sadie Sadie hey come here Sadie are you ready for the race Sadie come here <laughs> come here come here Sadie dog hi BB we got the car off the trailer and we got pretty much all of our last minute things done to it pretty much what we did since we unloaded was we put this cover over our battery so that because it's not supposed to be revealed we put some new rivets in got that covered and this was already on the car when we bought it these screens on the front end were, were already here but we had to take them off so that we could weld may run these kickers and stuff back for our front guard and so we went ahead and put these screens back on so that dirt and stuff doesn't fly into the radiator and the fans back there when the car is on the track so it's pretty much ready to go i'm excited to see this thing run for the first time i've seen a few videos of this car running with the previous owner but i'm excited to see it run now that it's ours it's got i'll show you the inside of the car there's this is built this car is built to be a two-man cruiser car is what it's called around here pretty much what that means is you have two people in the car so that's why we got two seats this is dad's seat and that's mine and you can see here we got the gas and the brake pedal on the left side of course and then over there on the right side you can see i've got a gas pedal so pretty much how uh two-man cruisers work is you have a guy on the left which will be dad and he'll do the steering and he'll do the brakes that's it and then i will be in the passenger seat and i am what's called the gas man and i run the throttle now tonight we're not going to do two-man cruiser tonight we're just gonna dad's just gonna run it in hobby stock uh running it against jonesy and a few of our other friends just so we can get a feel for how the car runs dad said it's not the best idea to throw two people in a race car that don't know what they're doing yet as well as, you know, we haven't run this car yet, so we don't even know how the car runs, period, with one person in it, let alone two. So dad's gonna run it tonight, which is totally fine. Uh, we're pro and then uh, guaranteed, uh, next year, we'll be uh, putting her in the two-man cruiser class. We only have a couple races left this year, like two or three races, maybe four at the most, if they decide to do a makeup. The last race got rained out, so at most, four more races and that's it. We pretty much got the last minute stuff done. We checked the fluids in her. She's pretty much ready to rock and roll, man. Jonesy is on his way. He should be here any minute now. He texted me about an hour ago saying that he was on his way. So he should be here pretty darn soon. But it's a nice day. It's just kind of overcast, kind of cloudy, nice breeze going. But yeah, pretty nice day for a first race for this thing. I'll show you guys the car again because I just love looking at this car. I love it, I love it, I love it. We got her all set and ready to rock and roll. This car is ready for some racing. I'm excited. Sadie, what do you think? I think Sadie's ready too. I'm ready to see this thing run. I'm ready. But uh, this is the inside again. We put all this padding on the roll cage. Got her all ready to rock and roll. This thing is as good as it's gonna get, I think. And I'm trying to give you guys as much footage as I can now of it because quite frankly, this is the prettiest it's ever gonna look. 
because uh, if you go back to my other video uh, off to the races, you can clearly see that a lot of the cars are dinged up because you're gonna get dents and dings and everything. But this is a new body. This is a, like I said, this car has only been ran uh, a few times. So this is a dent free body, but that won't last very long. <laughs> I'm excited to see this thing run. So we are going to just chill out for a while guys and uh, we will see you guys closer to race time. All right, here's our car again. I went ahead and I got all the tires down to about 25 pounds in the tires. Um, that's, a, that's kind of what, that's what we're gonna run them at tonight. And there's Jonesy, Jonesy's here now. They're out on the track in the big Massey Ferguson tractor uh, working the track right now. Dad is with him right now. But this is Jonesy's car, you guys saw it in the uh, off to the races video his is built just for you know hobby stock and stuff so he doesn't have a second seat like our car does but he is our competition tonight uh and as you can see it's definitely seen its fair share of races like i said you're gonna have dents and dings that's part of it <laughs> as a laughing gag we put a do not bump sticker on there <laughs> that's we did that a few weeks ago i put this I'm, i had this sticker made ain't scared I had it made a while back. I had two of them made, and they were actually made for uh, our car. But uh, we, I, we kind of, Dad kind of thought of a cool place on the back for ours. So we, I got two in case we wanted to put one on each side. But he found a cool place on the back. You can see it's right there. There's our ain't skeered, right on the back, kind of above the bumper there, but on the trunk there. And so the other one we gave to Jonesy, and he put it on his car. So. Um, and he loves it. So we both got an ain't scared on our cars. We're ready to rock, man. These cars are ready to go. We're ready. Because so many people came, they had to split it into two heats. So we really lucked out. Good lineup. That's a oh, here we go. Come on, Dad. Going green. Going green. Oh, 
Well, blew this, or blew this tire in the heat race. That's okay. Okay, here's the tire that we blew. I can't see if the tube got damaged or not. I can't tell, but this tire's done for. The rim, I think, is all right. We got a little bend here, but I think the rim will be okay. And then, of course, I guess I didn't really talk about it, but along with the flat tire, which we've already got changed, it's ready to go. We got our first, our inaugural dent, our inaugural rip in the body, which is bound to happen. That happens, not a big deal. This is just cosmetic. This doesn't affect the vehicle's function by any means. That's just its inaugural dent. But we got a new, our, one of our spare tires put on there. So it's ready to run again. We're about to start intermission. And then we're gonna see where we sit for the main feature races. We're gonna see where we sit. But we had a flat tire, our inaugural rip, but that's all right. She's ready to roll once again. All right, there he goes. Getting ready for the Concy race. We're in the back in fourth place right now. But if we get first or second, we move on to the main feature race. So we'll have to see. We're gonna get to, Dad's gonna hop on the track and we'll see what happens. All right, here's the Concy race. Oh, uh, where's Dad? There he is. Get up there, Dad. We're gonna start in the back. If we get first or second, we move on to the main race. If we don't, if we don't get first or second, we're done for the night. Okay, come on. Got the tire changed, so she should be good to go. Here we go, going green. We're gonna go green next lap. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. Go, 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 go. Green, green, green. Go, Dad, go. Damn, that's that back bar. Boom.
that was fun for the first night running our own car. That was nice. So we're going to head back to the pits and uh, see what's going on next. All right, guys, it is now 1140 at night. Me and Dad just got home from the races. Um, we are just going to be hitting the hay because I got to be up at 5 so that I am ready for work at 6 tomorrow. And Dad's going to be getting up early and getting to work, ready to start doing chores. He'll do them. He's going to do them a little bit later than normal, but he's still going to get up early. Um, but it was a really fun night at the races. I always have fun at the races, but it was a lot more fun because we had our own car in the race. And yeah, we had a little hiccup there with blowing the tire. And we got our, what I'm calling the inaugural dent, uh, the first to uh, rip off the body. But that is, that's what's, but that's going to happen in racing. You're going to blow a tire and you're, you know, you're going to blow multiple tires. You're going to blow tires. Your body's going to get beat up. You know, that's just part of it. Um, but I took some amazing pictures of the car um, before it touched the racetrack. Um, and I took a really nice one um, after the uh, tire change and we got our first dent because Dad had it parked after we changed the tire and the sun was starting to set kind of in the background and I got a really cool picture of it. Um, I'm a sucker for pictures. I love taking pictures of things that, you know that's going on in my life and I print them. There have uh, been quite a few times where I will uh, go through my YouTube videos and if I find something that, oh, that'd be a really cool picture to have in my photo album, I'll take a screenshot of... I'll, t I'll pause it and I'll take a screenshot and uh, I'll print that picture off. Uh, but I uh, hope you guys did enjoy this. Kind of a different video. Uh, we're still kind of in the dead season of farming right now. Uh, they really don't use me. They don't really need my help with a lot of things during the summertime. Um, I help with chores every so often. But um, my help isn't really needed during this time of year. So I do apologize. But... That's just kind of how it goes. But once harvest comes, it's already September, guys. So harvest is right around the corner. The corn is starting to turn yellow. It's starting to look closer and closer to harvest. We're going to have some amazing content. And I can guarantee you there's going to be some things that we do that I've never done before. And I'm super excited. I'm going to kind of keep them a secret for now. But I know for a fact there's going to be something I do during harvest time that I've never done before. And I'm going to make sure there's plenty of footage of it. So I hope you guys do uh, enjoy those videos coming up here in the next month or so. Um, but I hope you guys also enjoyed a different kind of video, the race video today. The debut race of our race car. Um, Dad ran it tonight in the hobby stock class. And did a very good job. He was kind of down on himself a little bit. Didn't think he was gonna doing well enough. But it was his first time running the car. He's, we, we're still figuring out how the car runs. So I'm excited for the future um, of our ho new hobby. Our racing career. Um, I'm excited for next year when the new season starts. So that I can jump in the car and be the gas man. And we can do two-man cruiser class. That'll be really, really fun. Um, like I said before, the only reason that we're, I'm not doing that this year is because there's only a couple races left in the season, and Dad wants to use those races to get used to the car himself, which I'm totally fine with me. I have no problems with that. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video here, guys. I need to go to bed. Hope you guys enjoyed watching the right debut races of our race car. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash the like button on this video. Spread the word of the channel, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching today. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.